Hello and welcome to my RPG Maker DX Ace tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to make uh, sheets in game. Uh, I just figure out how to make make sheets, like you input a number and it becomes a, a sheet. Um, I think it's many way to to do this, but I'm going to show you my way. So. If you open up your RPG Maker, mine is already opened. So you make a new new event. Maybe you want to pick a graphic. Uh, you can pick wherever you want to, like a a board that you sign on, or a computer, or something like that. But I don't have that graphic, so I picked a sign. It's the best at this situation. So, uh, the first uh, thing we're gonna do is insert a new one, a new command, like display choices. The first choice gonna be enter a code, and the second quit so press ok <coughs> when enter a code uh, you will pick numeric input processing you will pick a uh, variable I have made my, mine here the number 100 and call it anything you want I call it uh, my sheet sheet yeah name it wherever you want to apply press ok how many digits will you your sheet have and uh, mine will have six digits because I like the number six so I press ok you will make a new new command on the bottom right here you will pick conditional branch go to that one uh, the first page uh, you click on variable pick the variable you made mine is here sheet on the variable 0100 I press OK so is, uh, if this uh, variable is equal to a number my number is gonna be this is the code you enter if you enter this code something will happen and uh, so I will make like one 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 so I if I enter this code one 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 I uh, something will happen like God mode or uh, like gold you get stuff and yeah you know uh, make sure you have six digits because the variable got six digits so this must be six digits yeah you get it so on the, on the first one here you click on like if I enter one 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 I want the gold to increase so I change the currency by 99999 gold and make a text for it as well like you uh, gain 99999 gold uh, this is uh, right now it's uh, functional it's it works if I test play it but it's not fun to have just one code so we're gonna um, insert several codes so you will copy this one the first uh, conditional branch copy it and paste it on else under the else 
you paste it paste now we can make a new code so you right click and edit the code number to something else something random anything you like so I will put the number 999999 you can put wherever you want like blah blah, blah like that just just the code 999999 press ok so if I enter the digits 99999 something else will happen like insert like I will level up so I change the level for the entire party or someone else like the first one is you the one you're playing so I will enter his or hers level it will increase not set to a level it will increase the level t uh, with one uh, press ok you can make a text for it you leveled oh leveled up you leveled up press ok so we have make our second second code so you can copy that one and paste it under the else of the second code the second yeah the second co uh, conditional branch you put the new one on that else so paste it there and make your third code so you edit edit the con the third conditional branch and, uh, and change the number to you can say 12 12 12 okay and now something else will happen like change weapon I will get the weapon I made down here ultimate ninja sword it will increase by one and then text will pop up below that and says you got like there ultimate ninja sword press ok um, I think that's it <coughs> so uh, if I uh, play test this it won't work or it will work but it will look pretty ugly because you want to yeah by the way on the last else you made uh, you will make a text that says wrong code press ok um so he will uh, I'm just checking the protocol if this gonna work you do that da, 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 da. yeah uh, on the bottom you will make a label make a label name it wherever you want like one two three just remember it press ok so you have a label her here uh, so when you press quit you will insert a jump to label not label jump to label and remember uh, the labels name that you you done mine was one two three press ok so what it does is when quit he will jump down to this label and after that he will quit this protocol uh, 
if I don't use a label I can show you what happened then if I delete this one apply oh change this to same as character apply if I test play this yes new game and I press enter code or quit if I press quit it will say wrong code and I don't want him to say that when I just quit it because I didn't enter a code just gonna see if this is the same if I press that co code UJane999 gold see that work 999 gold if I enter the other code I made like 99999 you leveled up as you can see level 2 but as I said when I press quit I don't want him to say level up that's why we make a label because because uh, this is a protocol so we read from top to bottom so when he has read this one when I press quit he will continue to read until he hits the bottom and before he hits the bottom he will pass this one that's why he says wrong code so on quit you may you make a jump to label name it the same as the label you have so now when he when you press quit you will skip everything here and jump to this label and after that it's the end of this this list this event list so if I press apply and press ok test play it and now it should work I talk to the sign press quit and nothing happens that's good so that's it Thank you for watching and as I said I think it's many way or many ways to to do this on this is my way because I just figured this out today about an hour ago so so I'm a bit a bit proud of myself <laughs> but yeah if you have any questions please ask thanks for for watching. Bye.